now, our bonus presentation. Legend of the Army, T.E. Lawrence, the British officer, archaeologist, diplomat, master of disguise, and author. In 1910s, during the World War I, he sets off the course to travel to the AWAP against the Ottoman Empire. No thanks to you two. I call it the Ultra Awesome Monster Bike 2000, encased in a stainless steel exoskeleton. And hey, how about these tires, made of 100% patched together rubber? Hysteria presents the show after T. Launch, Launch of Arabia. You can count on me. On his way to the Turkish camp, T. Launch sets off to disguise as the Turkish trooper for the famous time. I brought the presents for you, Lao Tinderton. The box of chocolates, unfortunately, got caught by Talad Pasha, the Grand Vizier of Ottoman Empire. Seriously, did I say something wrong? You dare to become disguised as the Turkish Empire and Ottoman Empire? I'm Talad Pasha. I'm the Grand Vizier of the Ottoman Empire. I've caught you because you're a my prisoner, British spy. He's the Grand Vizier of Ottoman Empire, Talad Pasha. Seriously. All English spies. I, the Sultan, have ways of dealing with English spies. Now what? We can't go back to the company empty-handed. No problem, gentlemen. I have a backup plan. We can use your lunch to make a map. Tea time, chaps. Anyone for crumpets? Oh, totally different. And so on the show called Hysteria, Lyle Kittyton is about to wipe his chocolate hushing on his ropes. And as for Lyle Kittyton, the camel is about to follow him and decide to look at his ropes and decide to rescue him by eating his ropes like this one. And that is how Camel saves Lyle Kittyton's lives, including Fargo and T.E. Lodge. And so Lyle Kittyton says... Relax everybody! Look what Fargo made! And get a load of these handlebar grips! No problem. Explorers, courageous, adventurous, investigators of strange, unknown places they've never seen before. What's Luke looking at in the bottle? What do you see? Listen. First, you gotta divide Germany in four parts. I say, Peabody, old chap, whilst you're looking for the secret plan, see if you can find a tea cozy. Whoa, imagine my embarrassment. Naturally, the Sultan awoke and immediately sounded the alarm. Grab the plans, Lon, and right this way! We ducked our guards, began a frantic search. And so T. Lawrence had published himself, Lawrence of Arabia. And most important thing, it was the Turkish and all a man that lives in the desert during World War I. T. Lawrence, go fetch me the camel saddle. You can count on me. And I'll fetch the saddle for the camels to Lau Kittyton. And T. Lawrence said, Come get your Charlie Camel Saddle, Blau Kitty Tun! They're delicious! I like them because they're really short. Don't say short! Relax, everybody! Look what Frogo made! I've got a million ideas! Let's see. How about this one? Oh, you're gonna love this one! Teddy Roosevelt's charging up San Juan Hill. People, there's seven over here! Oh, rats! I am convicted of perimidating my spitter by the Ottoman Special Military Tribunal. I'm the one who is preposterous and the corrupted monstrosity. I am so arrested. Guards, come here quick! The English dogs are here! No can do, mister! You need to find a better spot! One week later, the entire Turkish army turned itself over to the British. If you had pulled the stem out and thrown the rabbit thing, nothing would have happened. Watch. It's got 60 days for destroying Secret Service headquarters. Back to the drawing board.
Have a beautiful time.